Oh, my friend who doesn't text me back is in town. Ooh. Burn. Fran. Bit harsh. Hello, everybody. My name's James. This is Desta, The Memories Between. It's one of our most innovative games of 2022, according to the Pokémon Awards, which you can go and watch over on the channel. And so I hadn't played it. I thought I'd go and take a look at it. And I'm going to... No, I'm going to leave that there. This is from Us Two Games. And these are the folks who did, amongst other things, Alba, Wildlife Adventure, Assemble with Care. But the thing you know them from is Monument Valley. And... They are known for doing this kind of thing where you have a floating platform in midair and you spin around and you move around like that. Very familiar. Uh, the other part of the game is slightly more interesting. It's like narrative adventure business, right? So this person's taken two moves. This is Desta. They've gone home to try and find out like what happened to their parents and, and all that. And uh, nothing's there. The place is empty. They've gone and had a little sleep. And now they've been transported into this world where they're going to start dealing with trauma. They're going to start having dreams about all the people who they used to live with, who they grew up with, who maybe they don't talk to anymore, or maybe they've uh, lost touch with. And, you know, we've all been there. Stressful kind of reminding yourself about awful things in your childhood. It's great, isn't it? Um, let's end this turn. And the way that Dester is dealing with the trauma is by collecting these memories and kind of fighting off hoodlums in the street. Now, it's a turn-based game, turn-based tactical thing, as you can see. I am going to move up here and go and grab the ball because my turn is going to be over in two movements. You basically got two actions every turn. And this Udlam might go and try and throw a ball at me. However, I've just picked up a power-up that, if I end a turn holding a ball, I get that little shield around me. So as you saw there, through the ball, nothing. You got nothing, son. Yeah. So I can now step out with my first action. Boop. And I can now... Throw the ball, bam, and eliminate them. You can see there are blocks above each of the characters. That's their kind of hit points, if you like. I have now resolved that dream, gained a bit of insight, and increased my movement range. Lovely. So initially, I thought this was going to be like pure narrative stuff because it starts with a kind of, you know, very, very beautifully animated intro sequence and you get the impression okay this is going to be mostly story and we're not going to play very much there is more gameplay here than i expected this rts bit is getting a little bit more uh involved which i'm very pleased about i didn't want to just be watching a thing and, and doing nothing else where is my character this is interesting i'm gonna no, no, i'm prepared let's go let's go baby there we are it gives you the option to kind of select if you have different power-ups i think which perhaps you want to use so Oh, look at that. My movement range is massive. So I'm going to go over here, and then I'm going to go over here. Grabbing the ball, as I said before, kind of offers me protection. So now let's see how this big fella... They've got three points of health. They're over there. Well, I can immediately just lob a ball at them, and then I might run away. So lob. Beautiful. And now I'm going to leg it behind this, behind this hedge, because they can now go over and pick up the ball. There's this thing of playing catch where, you know, you throw the ball at someone, inevitably, that happens. Uh, and now they're like tur they're turbocharged it or something oh god right now I've got two choices here I can pick this up and lob it at matey or I can end my turn or run away and avoid being hit or just tank the hit I'm gonna lob it at him because I've got three hits no wait 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 hang on hang on that glowing thing means it's gonna do two points of damage that's totally what that means isn't it so I'm gonna run around this corner and hide. Let's see what they do. I haven't been hit by one of these glowing balls yet. Are you just going to chase me around with that? Is that going to be the game? Okay, so instead, I'm going to lob. I'm going to lob the thing. Bang. Excellent. And now I'm going to run behind this corner. <laughs> I want to see how far his movement takes him and whether you know he still hasn't got enough points to actually hit me. That's good. Let's run away. Let's move around here. We can move the camera just by tapping on the screen and rotating. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to grab the ball. Once again, I am protected. End the turn. You can end a turn early if you want, like, you know, classic RTS stuff. Are you never going to throw this or are you just going to threaten me? It's because I've always got this shield, isn't it? Well, too late now, buddy. Kabam. Nice. So I'm gathering up this this insight point. Next up is new perspective. Okay, let's move on. I'm intrigued by this. Like, I like the fact every level is sort of...
different and distinct, you've got the different characters, and it starts showing extra wrinkles that you like, having, hey, maybe you've got a, a person who's backing you up on this level, like a, a partner who you can work with and you can throw things at and Finally use them Fran. to kind of, you know, intercept and whatnot. So Fran is a person I've been we trying to find. Mates. We grew up on the same street as each other. Our Fran who held the hair. Our up Fran. Our oh, Fran. Squared up to that guy for whistling at us. Hear me out. Not being in touch really hurt her. See, this is the thing. It's all that, hey, we were all great friends, weren't we? And now we don't. Now we don't really talk anymore. And, uh, and I think everyone's having that understandable reaction where you pop up and they're like, uh, where have you been? It's been 10 years. We've all had that experience, I'm sure. It's that like, hey, we're all going to be best mates at school. And hey, we'll never lose touch ever. And then inevitably time and life happen at you. And uh, it's brutal. So the only way to resolve it it's a lob of ball at their face. Here we go. Grab. Steady. Lovely. Force field. Come on, Fran. Let's play ball. Be nice. Come on, we were pals once. End the turn. Oh, no, wait. No, wait, no, 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 no. Hello. Sorry. I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to throw the ball. Now, obviously, I'm pulling back the ball in a kind of Angry Birds way. Oh, hello. Right. I didn't realize that. That's never happened before. If I can angle it so that the ball bounces back to me, I get to keep possession. Which, with this force field situation, is super, super useful. So let's see if I can do that again. This might be too far away. Hmm, didn't quite work out, did it? All right, but I'll grab it again this time. Bang. Okay, end turn. Oh, nice. I can also move this around while they're moving. That's good. Don't, Fran, don't run away. I want us to be pals, and the only way I have of coping with this is assaulting you with a volleyball. <laughs> Sorry. That's just the way things go. In my dream, I should specify. I'm doing this in my dream. You've made more so it's fine. Now than in the last bloody year. <laughs> yeah, message, well. Called anything. I know, I was worried you'd be like this. And the longer it went, so that's your excuse. Yeah, that's always the way. This little thing here, this this heart-shaped thing, you can see in the on the left-hand side of the screen, I imagine that's got to be like a, a little recharge station. Like when you fly over the blinking thing in Wipeout and turn. Is she going to run off and grab another ball? She is. Mm, okay. She doesn't have that force field thing though. So I think I've got one up on her. Let's make this straight and true. Not quite as straight and true as I'd like. Um, can I move away still? No, I can't. Right. Now Fran's going to get me, I think. There you go. So I might have to test out this recharge station thing just to see let's do it let's find out if it gives me my juice back i can't get all the way there yet i'm gonna go around the corner and hide hopefully fran can't get me this time and then i'll stand on it see if it gives me uh the juice back i think the netflix publishing thing has been ah it worked you just get the one though okay right experiment uh finished results achieved let's grab the ball and hang on and i've got another one behind me if i need it Mano, a mano. Let's do this. Yeah, the whole Netflix stepping into publishing thing has legitimately been interesting. And in the same way that Apple Arcade did their thing, it's provided an alternative for people who maybe don't want to do free-to-play stuff. And because everything pretty much here, apart from one, which I think is, was originally free-to-play and has been converted, all these games are sort of premium games that have been put onto the account and because you're paying for Netflix you get this as well so right let's lob this and then run away so point down brilliant and then we're gonna leg it back here Fran can grab the ball and run but she won't be able to throw it which gives me a chance to leg it over to that corner and I should I should Ooh, didn't even try and throw it at me Fran come here go on grab lush come on bring it I want to resolve this now, presumably later on, I'm going to see a lot more stuff where you have to bounce it off of things. You have to use the ricochet, right? I'm going to come up here just to make sure that I can definitely get around the corner and throw next time. But she doesn't have line of sight at the minute. Okie dokie. Hey, Fran. So, about that tortured past of yours. Bang! Oh, yeah. I'd left. 
left it so long. I thought you wouldn't want to be my friend anymore. But I presume uh, all of these volleyballs to the face have helped things. That's it. <laughs> You're mental. Hey. Oh, you speak to me late than never. It has. You're coming after me again, are you? Lovely. <laughs> I don't think I can do another round with my best mate. Ah, oh, it's all worked out. If it's been a week, all it took was a bit of tactical fun. Well. If you fancy a bit sort of something uh, emotional and narrative, but also a bit tactical uh, this holiday period, you can download Desta, the memories between right now, iPhone, iPad and Android, if you have a Netflix subscription. Just sign in and get it on your device. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Why has everyone got a clue? This video is brought to you in association with Infinity Party Battle, the new PvP tower defense mobile game. Stack your team with characters and spells, then match those characters on the battlefield to take them to new heights. Earn Infi tokens as you play, collect NFT characters and cards you can use within the game, and team up with friends to deal massive damage in co-op battles. Infinity Party Battle is out now on iPhone, iPad, and Android.